it's still on Mars. Uh, there's four people up here I've never talked to, and they are named. So let's start with Dennis Avery. Hello, welcome to the Sedonia UC Exchange. The best goods, all courtesy of the United Colonies, straight to all of the wonderful UC soldiers, workers, and other citizens. I've got a little of this, a little of that, and maybe a little of some other things you wouldn't expect to find at the UC shop, hmm? But that's because I try to provide for everyone here. So, please, browse my stock and let me know what I can get for you, friendo. Not to be rude, but where are you from? Ah, yes, it is the accent. I have been asked this before. Do not worry, I take no offense. From a very young age, I spent most of my life among the stars, aboard one ship or another. I picked up many ways of speaking, many languages. Because of this, the way I speak sounds strange to some, but that is the price I pay for knowing all the languages I do. Uh, do you get all your... It is illegal to transport plant or animal life to Mars without going through official UC channels or our trade authority partners. Adherence to this law is imperative in order to avoid unwanted infestation. Thank you for your cooperation. Do you get all your stock directly from the UC? The UC, my employer, they try to furnish my exchange with plenty, but other planets, they need more, so we need to make do with what we get. But me, I have other ways of getting goods to sell, and so I do. I get a little bit of this and that from here and there, and that is how I provide for you and me. You understand? I don't suppose you have any deals. Do I have any good deals, you say? Friendo, I am full of good deals. My prices may be fixed by UC pencil pushers many worlds away, but I may find ways to work with you. For example, I buy things to refurbish and resell. You bring me these, I give you credits, and we make deals. Well, that sounds good. Must be exhausting, man. You see those yes? Entire ship I'm waiting. Ah, oh, friend. You have no idea. You see. Not only do I sell goods for the United Colonies, I also need to receive the shipments, stock the shelves, manage the inventory. Why, even now, I have this big delivery. Tracking says it is here, but it is clearly not here. I don't see it, do you? The ship is out in the desert of Mars, not where it should be. Ship services tells me they can look at it, but I need my goods soon, and they're taking too long. That's what I'm here for. You can't just wait for ship services to handle it. Please, no. Have you ever dealt with them? I have. Too much bureaucracy. Everything takes too long. Some of the goods are perishable. You could do this for me much faster. And you seem better equipped than I to deal with any problems you may find on board. Did I read that wrong? No, yeah, I read that right. You can't just wait. Why did he sound like I told him to wait? Well, what do you think happened to it? What happened? I don't know. The ship was marked as approaching, then it landed somewhere out there, and that was the last I heard. Did it crash? I hope not. But maybe, yes, it did. That would be terrible. My shipment would be ruined. And the ship's crew. Oh, how tragic. What if? But we must not assume. We must be sure. And we must get my shipment. That is also important. Let's not forget. What kind of shipment is it? Oh, just various crates of supplies. Nothing unusual. Uh, you see what I have in stock, yes, friendo? More of that. The people here, they need their supplies. And I need to sell them supplies. And without that shipment, neither can happen, right? All right, I could go check in, check it out. You, you could, yes. This is what I hoped when we talked. If you go to where the ship was last seen, you could look at it, find out what happened. Take care of anything on board that shouldn't be there. Pirates, killer robots, heat leeches, whatever. 
and check the crates to make sure nothing is broken. Then come back to me, so I can send someone to recover the shipment and get to selling it. Easy as peasy, as they say. They do say that. Sidonia City Security is here to keep you safe. If you see something suspicious, please don't hesitate to report it to any security officer. No, ah, welcome back. Hey, oh. get you on the flip. No rush, but be safe out there. Just making sure you had no other dialogue. This starts the mission. Freight Fright. The manager of the Sidonia UC Exchange, Dennis Averin, is missing a shipment. The ship itself did not land where it was supposed to. I volunteered to help investigate. Found a clutch of I'm gonna get some quests. Even so. how far away it is and whether or not I should fly to it. Guess we'll run. You really need vehicles or something, you know? But then that would require them coding it. Oh, it's a firing range. Okay. I was like, someone's shooting over here. I'll we'll have to check this out later because there's probably going to be some kind of quest to go with it. Yeah, wait, why did they they land it out here? They didn't crash out here from the looks of it. And then there's the other new ship. I'm guessing that's because it's arms. Why am I still getting announcements all the way out here in the middle of nowhere? Also, for a second there, I was getting an extremely high radiation. Why is that? Why you radiate me? Don't do that. Don't do that. So far. Maybe I should have just flew. Because then I can fast travel. This isn't a crash. This is a land. Someone landed. It also looks kind of like my ma my uh, not my mantis, my razor. Oh, that's a different ship, right? No, it's just not put in the right location. Okay. 
have no enemies on my compass. Oh, this whole thing is the shit. <laughs> this was. <laughs> I thought it was like. Okay. Oh, um, never mind. I thought this was a facility and the ship was that right there. This whole thing is the ship. That's what all it is. Heat leeches don't kill people, do they? I found Dennis a ship, but it appears the crew is dead and the ship is overrun with heat leeches. I should eliminate them. Check all the cargo. Won't return it here. Heat leeches don't kill people? Let me calm down. Freaking dramatic music like this is something actually scary. It's running at me like a little puppy dog. Jabber A2, job 1467. Final log for Jabber, logistics ship A2. Job number 146789. Beginning descent into Mars airspace, Torcidonia N. What the? What's wrong? I'm losing systems. Something's cutting power. NAS offline. Comps are dead. That sounds good. Computers on the fridge. I'm going to try for an emergency landing. Shit! All two just vented. Life support is failing rapidly. Alert Galvin. Get your suits on and strap in. We're in for a rough landing. What about me? Don't worry about me. Hurry! Go! I'll be right behind you as soon as I set the ship to land. Delivering dry goods, 20 crates, medical supplies, 4 crates, consumer electronics, 15 crates, miscellaneous consumer goods, 8 crates. The new homestead was delivered with medical supplies, 15 crates. I don't know, all this stuff is marked out. Okay. Dry goods was delivered. Uh, Sidonia was receiving consumer goods, electri electrical components, and uh, construction materials. The 
these red lights and trying to make it seem like these leeches are scared. Unless there's like a mama. Must be transporting something that's got a high temperature, right? Expect the cargo for damage. These goods seem mostly intact, outside of some superficial damage to all the packaging. Do I really have to check all these? You expect the cargo for damage and open a container. Something squirms out and drops to the floor. It's a heat leech! That also missed? I must just have four aggroes. Inspect the cargo for damage. As you root around the contents of the container, nothing's noting some ruined consumer goods inside. A heat leech squirms out of the container and drops to the ground. I'm giving you heat. But do I not have it equipped? Hold on. Hold on. Um. Whoops. That was not supposed to go. There, now they want some heat. I can give them some heat. Uh, you inspect a car the cargo for damage. As you root around the contents, nothing are noting yada yada's the same way. The same way. At least the meat and the heat. Things fine. Bleach. all the heat leeches out. That one's fine. Heat leech. That one's fine. Hello. <laughs> oh. Jerk. Yeah, well, we killed all the heat leeches. Sounds good. 
just loot all this stuff. Still says I'm inaccessible. I eliminated the heat leeches and checked the cargo aboard the innocent ship. I should return to him and let him know what I found. Oh, there's hiccups. There is gravity. Normal gravity. How much over am I? Twenty over? I eat one of those things. One of those proton pack things. some weird battery thing that's supposed to it's supposed to increase your carry weight Meg Griffin. I don't remember. I'm trying to quote Herbert from Family Guy. But I don't know how old Meg is. The point is, he doesn't need her. straight line. I will find those battery packs that increase my carry weight and mm, apply them to my hop bar, foot bar, favorites bar, hand bar. I don't have a hand bar. Is there candy bars in this? I don't know what they are. It's just chunks. I'll have a chunks bar. Wait, that's a real thing, huh? Raisins in it, right? Like a chocolate bar with raisins? That's if I'm remembering it correctly. I don't actually know. I don't know. 
not running. Why is my oxygen still going down? Fine. All right. sell him his own cruise gear to make my money back. Oh no, it's all right. Oh, dang it. Well, I lost money out on those because I'm not relogging. <laughs> That's fine. Getting money in this game doesn't appear to be that hard. So now the question is, did Devin know? actually arrest hers but I just have to leave the community center on P1 is a good place to connect with others or any spiritual needs you may have let's turn this quest in first the lifeless planet of Ecterra a mining operation Sorry. run by Argos extractor was attacked by the group you know Rush but uh, well actually the quicker you find my cargo ship the better the ship crashed it was full of heat leeches but the cargo seemed to no, I hope they did not get into my cargo and ruin anything. As for the crew, I assume dead, yes? That is too bad. Too, too bad. But you found the ship and its cargo, and that is good at least. I will send someone to retrieve it now that you made it safe. Thank you. Maybe I will have more jobs for you, if you want. Sounds good, Devin. You looking for deals on off-world goods? Your new friend Dennis will hook you up. No, I'm here to sell this Take a look. Up so that I'm not over encumbered. Uh, the ship. And we can take this bounty hunter out with it. Get this shock trooper thing. This helmet. Both of those helmets. Jumpsuit, gray jumpsuit, double greaser. That'll be it. 